So this is the Mellotron uh, that is famous for, well I suppose the most famous thing is, is Strawberry Fields, uh, which is the Beatles. They were the, they were the, John Lennon was the first person to get a Mellotron um, and I've always wanted one. I used to have a real one which was massive, it was about, it was all of this space with tapes but then I thought I need to go wrong quite a bit, but now I've got this, this modern version of it, which never goes wrong. Oh, hold on. No. Oh. That's it. <laughs> But uh, you can also get, there's loads of, you know, instant lady singer. I mean, I think they're pretty good sounds. English horn. There you go. So we really, really completely run out of ideas. You can get busy on this. Um, and you can mix sounds together, which is quite nice. Uh, so like an organ. You can mix that with some, um, say some bass flute. So there's a flute, flute on one side, organ on the other. Then the organ and bass flute. can change the tone, you want it really mellow, and it's got a very good pitch as well. So sort of instant Tom and Jerry. But I like that pitch button, I use that quite a lot. Got accordion. Instantly in the beer keller, aren't you? Um, it just goes on and on violins. All in all, I think there's literally hundreds of sounds and uh, very, very useful bit of kit. The Mellotron.